people want to be heard and seen. What message can you give someone to provide them starting today with some hope for the future? Oh, that's easy. There's a thing called legacy. And I talk about most people focus on arriving well. I think you need to be mindful of leaving well. If we mm. begin with the end in mind, it will dictate how we arrive. So I'm coming into this new organization. I just got this new job, whether it's in professional sports or entertainment or, you know, in the private sector, in the military, whatever it is, I'm coming into this place of work, this place that will pay me money to do a thing. I am a representative of this entity. And I tell people, most of us will not be with an entity organization the entirety of our lives. So I tell people, when you're coming into that place, begin with the end in mind. How is it or what is it that I want to be said of me and the work ethic that I have brought to this space and the ethics for which I have modeled about my life in this space? What is, what is it that I want to be said? What would that, and ideally, what, what would I want that to look like? I tell people, you, you're going to leave your job one of two ways. You're either going to leave in a conference room with a cake <laughs> and people celebrating you or by an email saying your items will be mailed to you. <laughs> and I, and I've had both. <laughs> I've, <laughs> I've had both. And I've, and unfortunately I've had to, I've been on the uh, delivering end of both. So I tell people, if I, if, you know, I would just tell people right now, just be mindful of not just for the moment, be mindful of legacy, man. We get one chance regardless of where you, what do you think about faith or I think this life should not be a practice run. We should optimize with all we can to do to advance excellence. Doesn't mean we don't have grace, but I just kind of go, man, I'm showing up to this institution. I'm showing up to this organization. They've entrusted me, whether it's for a talk I'm giving or for an employment they're offering or for a platform they're providing, man, I'm, I'm best. Like there is no more this is the most important conversation I'm having right now. This is not one of 10. This is one of one. And so it is my posture. It should be our posture that with that in terms of how we advance not only the mission and goals of an organization we represent, but in the lifestyle we're committed to live. I think if we do that, lastly, I close with this. We do not control the day of our birth and most of us will never not control the day of our death but what we do control is the dash mm. the line that separates the two so be mindful of the dash man it's all about <laughs> the dash the dash is the decisions you make the relationships you form how you spend your time when you ask for forgiveness when you take responsibility when you lean in press in when you become the voice when you become the one who welcomes the stranger, when you become the Samaritan on the Jericho road, welcoming in the person who was bruised and battered by life. When you, le when you look out for the least, the leftover and, the, and, and those who are down on their luck, that's all of, that's dash. That's dash stuff.